so going back and looking at film, do you feel like there's positives to, to build on, or is it kind of a process where you got to kind of restart things? No, there's definitely positives to build on. We did some good things in that game, but it was overshadowed by obviously the bad things that we did. There's stuff we can build off of. We just got to we got to go back to the basics and get the fundamentals. And it's like we got away from what we started doing, started it like in camp and everything. We just need to go back to the basics and, you know, start from the bottom. How do you, what can you say to those tackles that, that whoever plays this weekend is going to not have a lot of experience? As a veteran, what can you do to help those guys out, mindset-wise, as much as technique or anything? Yeah, I mean, we just got to tell them. I, what I do is I usually tell the inexperienced guys to, that I'll always be there for them. Like, if they don't know what to do on the play, look to me. Or, if, like, if they're not sure about anything, ask me. But also that that guy was one time inexperienced, too. And you have to, like, you have to be prepared. Like, you have to prepare off the field for the game. And if they don't, then it ain't going to turn out the way they want to. I just try to, you know, Make sure I'm there for them and help them with the preparation off the field before they get to the game so they feel comfortable when they're in the game. How important is it to know that you know, it is a long season, but there's still a lot of games left to turn this thing around? If I get back to drawing where you guys want to be, what was that? How important to know for the guys that this is a long season and that there still is a lot of time, a lot of games left to kind of get this thing back going where you guys want it to be? Definitely. I mean, that's that's the main thing on our locker room right now. It's a very long season. And, you know, there's still a bunch of teams left and a lot of big teams. So we can go out, we can play good, and we can beat those teams, and we can still show that we're uh, one of the better teams in um, college. Chris Sager yesterday was saying he thinks that if, if you guys are able to get the running game going, it can help everything, help the passing game and pass protection too. Uh, what do you think that can do if you guys are able to get, you know, Cam and Jack West going? Oh, definitely. That, and that's, that's on us. we got to do better with that. Um, if we get a running game going, that opens up things for the pass. Then it also takes off the pass rush because they got to be aware of the run game. So if we can get the, um, the run game going, you'll see a lot, a lot more improvement in the pass protection. One more. Have you tried to help pick up Abdul and Jawan and people like that about men? Just concentrate on your technique and maybe things can get better. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm always encouraging my guys and. Um, trying to keep their head on straight and no matter how like what they see on Twitter and all this they ignore all of that. We've actually been trying to get guys off of Twitter like so they just and focus on just the team so we don't see any of the outside stuff. Alright, thanks guys. Okay. That's cool.